in this update video this will be my fifth one for my uni project for or for my games for my game and some of the few things I have done since the last vid last video includes actually having an actual name for the game instead of just calling it a collectathon I've come up with a name no Russian many many do as a play on because well you have to rush to the level to try and get as many gems as you can before the game before the time's up and not die of course but well that's probably one of the main reasons I did is just as a play on from what the game actually is the next thing I have done is actually added some simple textures to the actual level so the green is meant to represent grass and the dark grey is like rocks I well, class the walls as like a big rock face or something in front of it. The main reason it's not a proper texture, it's just a colour, is mainly because these are basic shapes, not geometric shapes. Geometric shapes allow you to align materials, while basic does not. That is the main reason why they're just green and grey instead of a grass texture and a stone texture. But I have actually one geometric shape and that is for the backdrop for the underground part where the caves are. Because if you look, if I scroll to the top, it's geomet geometry by there. So you can align it with the shapes and so under surface materials. It's not there. There's no surface materials. It's static mesh materials. Well, just we'll, we'll probably think that as. Think of that as surface materials see it's just nothing that goes direct to physics if I turn on a drop <laughs> and the next thing I've done is I've given the character a basic a texture I gave him a stone texture like it's like it's a stone warrior or something trying to reclaim his loot or something his gems I have not really put much thought into the the character at the moment I just wanted to give him a better texture than just the default white texture. Another thing I have done is on both the Time's Up screen and the You've Died screen, I've changed the name from You Have Collected, say, 32 collectibles to gems. See, Cle change both of them to gems. Well, some earlier backdrop with that, I've added a backdrop so you don't just look into the emptiness of the world and also I've changed the sky to be darker the main fo reason is that just because the backdrop for the game is in a wooded area so my thought would be if a darker sky makes the overall level darker to try and match the just theme of the level a bit more another thing I have done is all the power-ups now have textures as you can see here I can for the de for de for the death and media spike because well, if you thought it was spike it was you're gonna die <laughs> for the gems they just uh, a purple gem and for health increase and decrease it's red and green red meaning it's bad green meaning it's good and for jump boost and speed boost they're two arrows jump boost pointing up speed pointing to the right or left depend if I turn it left. That's around about everything I've done since the previous update video.